my name is Dr. Jean Cirillo. I'm a practicing psychologist in New York, and today we're going to be speaking about how to handle acting impulsively. Now, think from your own experience, a lot of times it seems like acting on your impulses leads to good results. But more often than not, especially if they're negative impulses, it can get you into trouble. Think about the time when you sent a nasty email to your boss, and of course you couldn't take it back. Think about the time when you accused your husband of cheating on you, when he was really planning a surprise party. You felt pretty bad after that, didn't you? Often, what happens is you start acting impulsively when you feel overwhelmed by emotions such as anger, deprivation, jealousy, whatever it is, there are certain events and certain things in your lifestyle that trigger impulsive behavior. So the first step is you have to notice the triggers. And then you have to work on noticing the consequences. Remind yourself what happened the last time you acted impulsively. The next thing to do is take 10 deep breaths, get into your body. Notice that when you're feeling overwhelmed by emotion, you're probably taking quick, shallow breaths. Breathe deeply. Notice the feelings in your body that come up when you feel triggered to do something you shouldn't do. The next thing is to memorize a line, a sentence, a phrase. We, in psychology, we call these coping statements. Something like, I don't want that cigarette right now. I'm full, I just ate. Or, I really have everything that I need. I don't have to go out and buy such and such and waste my rent money. Another thing to do if you really feel overwhelmed by an impulse is, just like you give your child a time out, give yourself a time out. Distance yourself, get away from the situation or the person that's triggering the impulse. Taking a little time away will ease you into coming back with better feelings. The next thing to do is to remind yourself how good you feel when you resisted spending your rent money and now you don't have to worry about the bills. Or how good you look in a bathing suit when you didn't have that piece of cake that you really didn't want. So the more you get into a habit of resisting impulses, the less you're going to have to worry about having to handle acting impulsively. I'm Dr. Jean Cirillo. I'm a practicing psychologist in New York. Mm -hmm.